The Hain company has made it incredibly easy to build subcomponents. This new machine allows you to put together all different kinds of combinations, stud block studs, and almost anything else you can think of, and nail them together efficiently, quickly, and easily with one man operating the machine standing in one place while he does it. To get the machine started, choose from one of the six different presets that are configured. The machine adjusts automatically. You can choose things like one nail on each side, or two nails on each side. If you're using a 2x6, three nails on each side. You can also do single-sided, one, two, and three nails. Let's say you put in a 2x4, but set it for a 2x6. Do you see that? We'll show you one more time. The top third nail isn't gonna fire because the gun recognizes that there's no wood there. To get started, you put your lumber in against the stop, spread it out, grab some pieces of scrap, and throw them in. Select a setting, and it's as easy as pushing the pedal. We've grabbed a couple of pieces of bowed lumber to show you another amazing feature of the machine. The clamping cylinders are incredible. Each one exerts 400 pounds of pressure. Collectively, that's 2,000 pounds of pressure holding things in place. They're going to squeeze that wood together tight and then allow the nail guns to secure them in place. Watch as these clamps come down on the wood. Look at that. The clamps can adjust independently and vary to accommodate virtually any configuration. This offload sensor scans as the wood goes through. When you're done with that component, it triggers the ejection system. Look at that straight lumber. Easy access panel doors let you get to your nail gun within seconds. The subcomponent nailer uses standard nail guns. The mounts are non-invasive. The only modification required is for the nail gun chute. This air tank supplies constant pressure to the guns. When you run out of nails, changing the nail coil is easy. You put a new one on, put the arm back into position, and then slide the nails back down into the magazine. There's also a nail saving feature which tells the guns to fire in an alternating pattern. Let's go back to the stud block stud we started earlier. We're going to run it through a short time test. The idea is to show you exactly how valuable this piece of equipment can be to you on your job site. Load the wood, line it up, and press the pedal right where you want the nail. It's so simple, you even have time to make adjustments as you push it through the machine. Even at this relaxed pace, we're still making great time. An experienced crew can average speeds of 25 seconds per component. Our test ends here. 33 seconds for a stud block stud. You do the math. <laughs>